Today we are going to learn how to fabricate a piece of duct. Duct comes in all shapes, sizes, lengths. They all have different seams and connectors. Based on the size of duct and the length of the same duct, calculate your cut size. Measure your piece, and as the old saying goes, measure twice, cut once. I am now setting up to mark my connectors and seams. This is for the Yesen drive, half inch. Setting the dividers to one inch. Scribing one inch, that's my working line. And the Pittsburgh seam on the side. I will then add a quarter inch to the opposite end for the male part of the Pittsburgh seam. Now you will see me squaring lines upward representing the duct dimensions. Now that the notching is complete, let's make our way to the Pittsburgh lock machine. Yes, it does look old and makes noise, but it works just fine. Next will be the bender. At the moment, I am bending the quarter inch male end for the Pittsburgh. Then I will bend up all brake lines for this wraparound duct or one piece duct. Here you are using the cleat bender bend a half inch over 180 degrees to prepare for future drive cleats. <laughs> 